Welcome back to the Plays With Cars YouTube channel and another episode of Hot Wheels Detailing. Today we've got one of the hottest new Hot Wheels to hit the market. Um, well, the Hot Wheels itself isn't that new. This is from last year, the Porsche 917 LH. What is hot about this one is the paint scheme. This is the Martini and Rossi Hippie Paint Scheme. Uh, done up obviously without uh, sponsored decals, but correct color, correct craziness, correct racing number, and it makes for a very, very cool looking Hot Wheel in the package. And out of the package, let's go ahead and pop this one open here, and you will see a nicely detailed model. Uh, this is... Porsche's Endurance Racer for Le Mans started in 1970. It won uh, quite a few, actually. Was it two or three? Uh, and then the 917 kept evolving into other endurance racing Porsches. Uh, but this is the original. This is the uh, the LH um, Long Heck, which is German for long tail. That's the extended tail here to go faster on the Mulsanne straight. Uh, at Le Mans, so this is a really cool car, really cool casting, really nicely done. Um, however, we're still going to detail it, so some of the issues here are, and I'll use my silver sharpie here as the pointer, no taillight detail or grill detail here on the back, same thing here in the front, no grill details in the front. Now they do do a smart thing with uh, the headlights. These headlights are actually clear plastic. They are part of the windshield piece. So when they assemble the car, it's like a sandwich. You have a metal body on the top, uh, then this clear piece, which includes the windows and the headlights, and the black plastic uh, interior and motor, and then the plastic base goes on last. So what that means is that these corners here of the underneath the lights are part of the plastic base. So you do get a little bit of different coloration there because of that, but still it's really smart to do that. So other things we had, uh, the little grills up in here, uh, the windshield wiper, engine could use some detail, and your gas caps and stuff like that. So now that you've had a nice good look at the 917 Martini Rossi, let's go ahead and detail it up. So... Uh, let's see, where are we going to start? You know what, let's go ahead and start on the tail lights here. We're going to use the regular silver metallic sharpie. And just going to catch the tail lights like that to give the red some background to reflect off of. And up here on the engine. Right here. These are basically intake manifold plenums, if I remember right, on the flat 12 motor. And um, the thing in the middle is the cooling fan. All right, next, let's go ahead and take out our black ultra fine point. These have a much finer point than a regular Sharpie, and they do really great for grills. You kind of get in there just like that. Now on this car being such a dark color you don't really see the lack of grill but then once you have finished the car and you put it next to one that hasn't been done it becomes pretty obvious. But the other nice thing about the ultrafine is you can get in like these little uh, air exit ducts and intake ducts and get just down where the little duct is. Same thing here on the little NACA ducks. It's just that little bit more of definition. Again, we're trying to take this dollar car uh, and make it look at home on the dis in the display case with the, you know, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten dollar and up cars. So you do that by getting all these little details picked out. That they pick out for you at the factory. Okay, so we got all the grills done there in the front and the back. And the sides. And these little guys up here, I'm not sure those are going to be worth doing because you can't see any difference. Nope. Okay, so we will leave those alone. However, we will do this windshield wiper. It is sticking out like a sore thumb 
on that clear window. So if they're going to mold it in there, we should probably color it in. There we go. That's looking pretty good. Got some black on there. Just, just, just a bit. Just enough to get it going. Now, some fun stuff. The wheels on this car are black. I believe the wheels on the real race car uh, were a raw magnesium finish uh, or a, a coated magnesium, which is called Dow 17. Uh, and it makes for a very kind of goldy bronze color. So I was going to try making these wheels gold to see if that might look a little better than this just plain black plastic with literally uh, no paint or deco on there at all um, not even like glossy black or anything they just they're literally raw black and again the whole point of these videos is to show that you don't need any artistic talent or background in model building or anything like that anybody can grab some sharpies and chrome pens and things and learn how to detail a Hot Wheels car and make it look better. Check that out, that looks a lot better. The gold versus the knot. So we'll go ahead and do the back wheel too. This is a little harder because the wheel does tuck up under that wheel skirt just like the 1-1 version of the car. So you do have to kind of like spin the wheel around to get to everything. These are like some 90's classic Hot Wheels 5 spoke wheels. Like one of the first ones they did when they got away from the um, red line esque but black walled old school chrome 5 spokes. Yeah look at that. Okay. I mean what would you rather have on yourself? That? Or that. Right? Yeah, it looks way better. So we're going to go ahead and do up these other two wheels too. And again, I am doing this through a camera. I've got a giant honking camera. Well, not giant, but I've got a pretty decent sized camera in between me and the car. And so sometimes I'm doing this looking at the screen. Sometimes I'm like peering over or around the camera. So my apologies if things aren't perfect or I bump things around. Uh, it's a lot easier for me to detail Hot Wheels without filming it, but what fun would that be? Because then I couldn't share it with everybody and encourage all of you to detail yours as well. So those of you who are subscribers to my channel and are watching this on launch day, I uh, saw earlier today that today, which is December 3rd, 2019, uh, is the one-year anniversary of the Plays With Cars YouTube channel uh, being launched as its own channel. And um, we started with Hot Wheels with how to fix the Mazda 787B rear spoiler, um, and then actually a detailing. We detailed a... Uh, 73 Mustang or 72 Mustang, you know, the big body ones, the ones from uh, 007, uh, detailed up one of those using Sharpies and stuff. So, uh, kind of one of our first videos on the first day was detailing Hot Wheels stuff. So, uh, this video is a tribute to that. We wanted to do, uh, make sure we did a special Hot Wheels detailing on uh, on the date to uh, to honor that so anyways we got our wheels all done here we're on to the next step which is going to be the chrome we're going to use the Molotow liquid chrome pen Let's see I'm looking for the one mil version where does it hmm where did that go well there we go two mil so this one must be the one mil okay it's like we've lost our sticker off the ha could just open it up I guess all right so what we're gonna do here is the the fuel cap here I'm gonna do that in the chrome now again these Malatow chrome pens this is like real liquid chrome in here this is not 
silver like a sharpie it's chrome and the finish is very different so use the silver sharpie in situations when you're looking for um, like bare aluminum or steel or a metal and you use the chrome when you literally want chrome just like that on those oil caps and I do believe that is it for chrome on this car I'm just double checking everything yep so just those two little fuel caps now we do need to do the red on the tail lights there's been enough time gone by that that silver will have dried enough so let me just bloop like that now we've got red tail lights on there and I think that's gonna about do it for this one so you can see here on the back we've got blacked out grills and red tail lights now on the side we've done our gold wheels to look like bare magnesium uh, in the front we did the grills as well and then on the top we've got chrome on the uh, fuel and oil caps we blacked out the uh, all the little grill inlets and the windshield wiper and did the rocker covers so that is your finished product that is the Porsche 917 LH in the Martini uh, hippie paint scheme one of the hottest new Hot Wheels uh, done up enough to look at home in our display case with all of our other super nice high-end Hot Wheels and it will definitely definitely hold its own uh, now that we've detailed that so hope you guys really enjoyed this particular episode of detailing Hot Wheels here's on the plays with cars YouTube channel again this one is in tribute to uh, our launch video a year ago today uh, for detailing Hot Wheels and the Mazda 787B. So we got us another Le Mans racer. We got us some detailing stuff and we set to work. So hope you've enjoyed it. Until next time, this has been Plays with Cars.